So guys, today in the defensive class, we are going to continue our uh let's uh, it's a little questionnaire about um diversity of subjects. Now we start with technology, okay? And we are going to discuss about communication technologies. So what are some popular communication tools or apps? people use today uh, let me see here lavinia what are some of the uh, common apps that people are using nowadays lavinia are you there um yes i'm there Good. um so what apps are do you have to use today oh uh, okay um Social media study apps like Forest. Um, it's really good and I recommend because you can keep folks that and don't uh, use, a, use your cell phone. And mm -hmm. it's really good. Yeah, study and, apps. And some apps that we use for communication. Which ones do you use or we don't use it yet? Um, WhatsApp, WhatsApp, WhatsApp? yeah, mm -hmm. and and Messenger sometimes, but I don't use Messenger. I just keep using um, WhatsApp because it's better. Okay, we have more features, right? Yeah, more features. That's it. That's good. Very nice. Anybody else knows any other applications? Uh, Julio, Sabrina, Tayani, or Fatima and Edson. Do you know any other applications besides WhatsApp and uh, Facebook Messenger? Which ones do you? Telegram. Do you... Yeah, Sabrina? Telegram. Telegram. Is it? Yes. Uh, because your your microphone is a little bit low. Oh, sorry. I am not. Okay, now it's better. Do you use Telegram? Yes. But you use more Telegram or WhatsApp? WhatsApp. <laughs> ah, okay. And why do you use Telegram for? For what? Um, my telegram <laughs> is in my notebook to, mm. I use it to watch a series. Oh, <laughs> so you use the telegram for finding uh, illegal websites to watch yes. TV shows. That's, <laughs> that's not good. <laughs> That's bad. <laughs> don't <laughs> don't do this. I'm sorry, but I will do it. I I wanted to know. I know it's true. People do that. <laughs> do this is it's the same time is amazing is bad, you know. Yes, yes. Do you use this no. too loving or not? Uh, no, no, because I don't yeah, I have um Telegram on my cell phone, but I don't um, use use it. I I really don't see it. Don't use okay. it. Important to know. We yeah. don't uh, we don't uh, agree with illegal uses of <laughs> social media here. Okay. 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 Not online, by the way. So, um. In your opinion, how has technology improved long distance communication? Uh, let me see who is going to answer this. I think Julio, are you there, sir? Yes, I'm here. So, sir, tell me, how uh, has technology improved long distance communication? Okay. Technology, it's, uh, 
a great devel development of communication of distance because you can talk uh, like face to face with someone who is who is there so long, so far from you. Mm -hmm. And, and at the same uh, time. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. About this face to face experience. Uh, which apps yes, or which websites do you use for this? Okay, I uh, uh, I think two months ago I use uh, some apps to practice English conversation. Mm. Which ones? Um, today I. Today, uh, nowadays, I don't use it uh, because I don't have time. It was mm -hmm. real life and uh, hello. Mm. And how does it work? Is it work okay, good? How was it? Mm, it does not work uh, perfectly. Sometimes mm -hmm. uh, I had uh, problems with uh, audio. Sometimes I can't uh, keep a conversation with the other person because uh, problems with uh, with a call. Mm, I got it. Right. Sometimes it happens, right? But mm. it was good to to practice uh, conversation. That's that's nice. That's nice. And oh, look who's here! But let me ask about Tayani. Tayani, tell me, um, how does has technology changed your daily life? About your daily routine, how does it change your life? Um, what's up? Hmm. Como que a tecnologia mudou sua rotina de vida? Hum. É. Eu acho que não mudou. Não. A gente pode conversar, na verdade, a gente pode conversar com pessoas longe, né? Pessoas de outra cidade. É. Hum. A gente pode a gente conversa com a gente pesquisa as coisas na internet para para ver sobre o que a gente quer pesquisar também uhum. e a gente para ap é, aprender um pouco sabe com as coisas que a gente falar a gente eu vou pesquisar isso para saber o que é isso entendeu uhum. got it got it ajuda nice. né? uhum. <coughs> um, let me see here what about you, Chieli? What about you? How has technology changed your daily life? Um, hi. Um, Good evening. Uh, provavelmente foi um pouco do que ela já falou, né? É, a possibilidade de, de você é, se comun é, communication né? in many people. Good. And uh, in your opinion, what are some potential drawbacks of relying too much on technology? What are the side effects? Side what effect. are the side effects? Yes. Do you know when you when you take medicine, you have the the good way, yes, the good part of taking medicine, and you have the side effects. For example, if you drink uh, medicine for headache, you, you can seize your headache, good, and then you have some side effects. It can make you feel bad on your stomach, for example. Okay? Uh... Understand the idea? No problem. Everybody is today. Today is not a good day for uh, anyone. Today, today, look around. I've been so, so. 
Mm -hmm. Me too. I had bad experiences today. So I am here only because I need to, because I don't want to for today, <laughs> because my head is not here. My head is somewhere else, but I have to focus. So what are some potential drawbacks or side effects? What is this? Is for example, if you use too much WhatsApp yes. in your life and one day you stop using, I don't know, your cell phone dies, the battery goes off, you lose your charger, you cannot charge your phone anymore. You don't have internet to connect with the internet. So, uh, and then you feel bad and you feel stressed. What are some um, side effects like this that we can have because of technology? Um, so, uh, oh, tipo, desvantagens, digamos assim. Yes. Você, Quais são os uh, lados ruins? Ruins. Uh, yes. Ruins. Uh, inveja. Uh, privacy. Privacidade. Invasão de privacidade. Privacy. Invasion. Yes. Yes. Privacy. Invasion. Yes. Good. And what else? Like... Only this that you can imagine. É, é, because the people, é, as pessoas se expõem muito, né? Uhum. Então, é, dá margem também de você é, de ser, ser, ser invadida, né? Você perde é, os seus dados, uhum. seus, suas informações. Yeah, sure, sure, it's important. Então, sou, não é mesmo? So, uh, as well. What, sorry? Dependence as well. We... Nossa, me desculpa, tá passando um avião aqui. Parece que ele tá pousando no meu teto. <laughs> Só um momentinho. Just a moment. Okay. Can you repeat, please? Dependence of technology. Mm. And I uh, have a it... history about it. Because no, no. I... No problem. I, um I do biology mm. and mm -hmm. next year, next year, sorry, last year mm -hmm. I went to Ilha Grande in yes. Janeiro to do um, um camp trip. I, I don't know the, the term. Uh, the Mm-hmm. Okay. You made and like a... in the in the house where we we stayed. 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 We don't have internet and we needed to mm. do seminaries and we had to only search in books and ask for for information to teachers, so... Oh, my God. It was crazy, but it, it was funny because it's a, a new experience because we are very dependent of technology and we was without every internet. But how, how do you manage to survive? <laughs> in this completely different society that uh, reads books <laughs> we had a lot in this situation of... with no internet and I don't know like the cavemen lives you know like <laughs> when they were in the stone age we had two how we had very many questionnaires to to answer <laughs> how is it possible how are you alive i don't know i don't know this christ imagine you want to bake a cake you want <laughs> to make a cake a chocolate cake 
but you forgot the recipe and you have to search in books. <laughs> yeah. Bonabenta's books. <laughs> it was crazy. Jesus Christ. Lavinia, tell, tell me, tell me, do you believe this? Do you okay. believe this? Uh, yeah. How come? Is no, it I, possible? No, I don't, no, I don't believe. Oh. <laughs> oh, Is sorry. It possible? Can you survive in this world without technology and cell phone, internet? Um, yeah, I can't so survive with it. Yeah, and I like reading books. Um, my uh, mother has a, a, a notebook um, mm, that she writes some recipes. No, laptop, no. no the notebook, just really? a notebook. Notebook. Jesus Christ. She writes by hand. Yeah, writes by writing by hand um, rec her recipes. Oh, gosh. This is so God. awkward. No, of this course no. So I like reading my, books. My grandmother used to do this. My grandmother do that, you know? No, grandmother, no. She's oh, 85 God. years old. I, I, I like to be offline sometimes, okay? And I'm not, uh, okay. and I don't want to be rude. Good. I, I ask, I, I will ask you to do one thing for, for our studies here, okay? Okay. I suggest if it's possible for you, okay? I'm not telling you to do this because I want you to do this or you are obligated to do this. It's only a matter of studies, if you can, okay? So, okay, and, and I like I'll to ask, study online. I'll ask you, I'll ask you to try not to use even the computer or your cell phone or a tablet, whatever, any kind of technological stuff for two days straight in a row. Like, for example, you stop using it on Friday morning and you're only going to get it back on Sunday. Is um, it possible not to use your cell phone, laptop, anything, television, nothing? Only books, magazines, uh, you know, talking to people, real people. Do you think you can do this? Um, so so. <laughs> See, it's so hard. It's difficult. Okay, let's let's ask another person here. Um, Julio, do you think it's possible to survive forty-eight hours without any any technological item around you? I'm not talking about lamps. Okay, lamps are permitted. I'm talking about TV, smartphones, and laptops and computers in general. Okay, I think it's possible to survive 24 hours, but uh, I think the most important is uh, uh, food that we have to use fridge. fridge. Mm -hmm. The fridge, yes. Yeah. No, you can uh, use the fridge. I'm not banning the fridge. <laughs> I am banning banning only smart stuff. You know. Okay, I see. Oh, so, you don't. Uh, you cannot use the the cooking rice pan. You have to use the normal pan to cook rice. Yes. So I think it's very very hard to to survive without these technologies because. Um, I think uh, everybody today need these tools to for their job for our job. Yeah, sure, that's true. I can't, I can't, I can't make a trade with someone because I have to use credit card and I have to mm -hmm. use 
WhatsApp to make a budget. And, and everything is connected to the internet, right? Yes, exactly. Okay, good. Let me change the subject now because we talked a lot about this. Uh, but I have... Oh, Daniel, are you there? Hello, Daniel. Daniel? Hello? It's me. Daniel, can you hear me? Please answer me. Okay, he's not there. He's not there, guys. Be careful, he's not there. So, let's change. Next part here is sports and recreation. So, here, what do we have? We have to talk about different sports and recreation activities, discussing the popularity rules and the benefits of participating in them. Okay, so here, what are some popular sports here in Brazil? Um, Mr. Let me see here. Mr. Uh, let's start with Julio. Julio, what are some popular sports that we have here in Brazil? Julio? Okay. Hello. I, think ah, the, I think the most popular sport in Brazil it's football yet soccer uh, right soccer, soccer. Mm, good and what else do we have here uh besides soccer we have more sports right yes uh i think you have skate skateboarding yes. yeah i think so uh what else we have one that people People play with balls too, but they use the hand. To uh, play. Volleyball. Yes, volleyball. Very good. Uh, tell me the name of a famous volleyball player. Oh my God. I know a lot, but at the moment, I can't Forgot? remember. Forgot? Okay. <laughs> Is it Jiba, right? Okay, Jiba Murilo. I think he has already retired. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Me too, I think so. Serginho. Do you know? Uh, we have... Uh, I'll try to, to open here. Can you see this? I hope, I hope my Instagram has nothing inappropriate here. Okay, fine things. So, do you know this guy here? No, I don't know. Don't know? This guy's no. name is Hinata. He is from this animation here. He's from this animation. Is about volleyball. See? A lot of guys playing volleyball. And it's a very good animation. If you want to see something about volleyball, you can watch this. Put in English, okay, and watch. It's very nice. Very and good. he is the shortest guy on the on the square. Him and this one here, both are like uh, under one meter and seventy. They are both is uh, short guys, and they are one of the best players. So. Um, which sport do you enjoy watching or playing the most, and why, Mister? Tell me. Okay, I like to watch uh, soccer. Match soccer. soccer. Mm -hmm. yeah. Now ask a friend, ask a, a colleague here, which sport they prefer. Okay, let me see. Can be Sabrina. Mm -hmm. Hi, Sabrina. Hi. What kind of sport do you like? Good boy. Very nice. I don't like sports. 
sorry. Don't like sports. No. But you are a biologist. But what? <laughs> so you enjoy life in general <laughs> and for a living you need to do exercises and exercises is a kind of sport see everything is related <laughs> well <laughs> I like to dance oh see it's a sport uh, something like that and I do the gym, but I don't like to watch sports too much. Don't like to watch? The, you go to the gym, right? You said right now. Yes, yes. Do you follow Paulo Muzi on social media? No. No, you have to follow him. He's amazing. I don't he's a doctor. Him. Oh. He is a doctor. Paulo Muzi is a doctor. And he's a physiculturist too. I, I, I will not search on Google here because can we can have some images that are not appropriated for the time. <laughs> oh my god. Because he's a physiculturist, so probably we are going to see pictures of him bath in oil and doing strange poses, okay? <laughs> we okay. don't want this I, right I now. I understand you. We don't want to see naked men right now, okay? Yeah, I agree with you. But um, between dancing and uh, mm, working out, that is uh, the gym stuff, uh, which one do you think is the most... Uh, um, uh, you feel more comfortable practicing? hard <laughs> I think doing the gym going to the gym is more pleasant for you it's more comfortable but okay. dance is more what is the word um, pleasant, pleasant 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 yes pleasant is this here let me write here for you it's like this Pleasant. Pleasant. Okay. Okay. That pleases you the most. Okay. So you you think that dancing is more pleasant, but you have more affinity doing workouts, right? Yes. That's good. Do you go to the gym every day? No. <laughs> Three times a week. Four. Three times, times a week. week. Mm. And how many days do you do the leg day? Leg day, um, two days, and I, then you I go three only times. I have two days, leg day and arm day. So you go three times a week. You do two days of leg day and one day. No, you no. do the rest. I I usually go four times. And uh, okay. two of leg, two of arm. Okay, good. It's important, okay? Important because, girls, listen to what I say and do the possible to do what I want, what I, I tell you to do. If you want to have a negative belly, like... Oh, I want to have no belly at all. So <laughs> you have to do all the exercises. Please don't yeah. skip arms day. Don't skip abs. Don't skip your cardio. Don't skip this stuff because it's important. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. The same goes for the guys, okay, who goes to the gym. Don't skip leg day because the leg day is going to make you suffer and sweat rivers. And Don't because of that... Johnny Bravo. Yes, you, you are going to become a pizza slice, you know? Wide <laughs> on top a and lollipop. narrow. On the... <laughs> a lollipop. <laughs> it's going to be so funny. Um, but 
No, you know Johnny Bravo. It's like this guy here. What? Ah, here we have images. Johnny Bravo, show us. See, this is what happens to you if you skip like day. Okay, you are going exactly. to be wide here and narrow here. It's going to be strange. See, it's very strange. Look. <laughs> very exquisite so um if you want to lose weight lose your bellies you have to do cardio and you have to do leg day okay um let me see here mm. Mm. oh yeah sabrina tell me which dances do you know how to dance yeah. Which dance do you dance? Do you practice? Do you practice valsa, salsa, classic dancing, hip hop, zumba? What is the dance you practice? Any, any specific style? Um, K-pop? No. Oh, thanks God. I use it to like K-pop. Oh, but, no. But... <laughs> I never dance. Okay. BTS? No. No. Oh, thanks. Thanks. What about, uh, I don't know, Super Juniors? <laughs> no. I'm, I'm only 20 years old, okay? Okay. How old are you, if you don't mind? What? How old are you, if you don't mind? 25? Okay. Because Super Juniors is like 40 years old, the guys. Yeah. He's not the juniors yeah. anymore. They are seniors right now. Yes. Okay. Um, Mr. Where is Julio? Julio, do you dance? Or not? Uh, I'm not a good, I'm not a good dancer. <laughs> no, no, I just not try the... sometimes to dance slow. Not uh, even the dance of old people dance that is only the shoulders like going up and down, you know. Sorry, Guys, do I you know that. how old people dance? Yeah. I'll try to <laughs> exemplify. I'll try to exemplificate for you here. Imagine I am an old person, yes? And then the old person is in the party and then start dancing. Yes, I dance like that. Yeah? <laughs> so, do you do this? Yes, I do this, uh, especially when <laughs> I take some beers. <laughs> oh, God, it's so good. What about you, Chieli? Do you dance too or not? Yes, uh, ballroom dance. Ooh, that's good. My, my sister is tittered ballroom dance, you know? Mm, she's a, she's a, she's a teacher. Like, she uh, teaches people how to dance? Yes, I do what is the song. That's so good. That's so yes. nice. And you, do you have classes with her? I repeat. Do you have classes with her? Ah, yeah. Uh, no, já, 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 já estive, mas não, não. Not não, anymore. Não vou mais, ter, não. Ah, okay, got it. Dá mais tempo. Mm. Time is a challenge, yes. And I see here, Tiani loves. BTS. Yes, Tian. Yes, Tayani. About this, what in your def defense you have to tell about it? What about K-pop? Tell me your opinion. Uh, na verdade, eu nem sei direito o que é. No. So... You don't know. <laughs> so... Eu... Escuto o nome, falar. é algo familiar, mas não sei nem o que é. 
Okay. Explain <laughs> to us, please, Tayani. Tayani, explain it to us. What is the universe? <laughs> No, uh, make it simple, please. Make it simple. Bom, é, K-pop agora se tornou uma das músicas mais ouvidas do, do, de, de todas as músicas. Punk, tipo, mas é, as pessoas elas é, vêm escutando mais agora K-pop por causa do, do, de um grupo da Coreia por ter elevado o K-pop para o mundo todo agora. Ah, e o grupo e foi? Core... Eu fui BTS. Foi o BTS que ganhou o M, né? Yes. Três premiações, yes. foi? Três premiações? Yes. E dança-se yes. como isso? <risos> Porque eu tô aqui imaginando <risos> DJ Ramon e, e, não, e você dançando isso. Do you know? Guys, Do you know? Do you know why? Do you know why? I know. I know this. Quero vídeo. I know this. Não, é difícil algum. É difícil. É difícil algumas danças de sim do de K-pop. Não é muito fácil aprender não. Sim. Oh, look, look at this. É muito. Uh, a pessoa movimenta muito, né? Dance practice. Tell me a name of a song of BTS that you like. Uh, uh, Dynamite. What is it? Dynamite? Yes. Dynamite. Dynamite. Look, this is, this is K-pop, okay? Where is the, the dance practice? This one yes. here. Look, this is K-pop. Oh God! Yes, yes. Oh God! Yes. No, let, let me put the sound here for you guys, so you can understand. Look. Okay, so I know this. I know these guys. I don't know the name of these guys. Okay, to be clear, I think some of them, uh, one of these guys are Sugar, maybe, probably. One of them are is John Cook. Okay, yes, yes, is John Cook, and another one is Jimmy. I don't know, J Hope. I have yes, no idea. Yes, yes. So, Yes. These guys here, they are like the Backstreet Boys of today. <laughs> See, yeah. it's the, the only explanation I have for K-pop is boy band or girl band of people yeah. who likes to dance in a strange way. I can't yeah. follow. Look at this performance. Uh, uh, teacher. Um detalhe nessa nessa nesse One, two, three, four, five, six, seven Eles... guys. Yes, tell. Então é um detalhe nesse no Danimate eles homenagearam o Michael Jackson. Uma... Mm -hmm. Ah, uma... ah, eu tava vendo o movimento. Ele tem muita coisa americana nesse espaço aí. Yes, yes. Eles It's homenagearam o Michael Jackson nessa... Eles homenagearam o Michael Jackson nesse MV. Uh, one thing that I feel very uncomfortable about Korean boys. All of them have straight, beautiful hair. And I am like, okay. I'm never gonna have these hairs on my head because I'm getting bald. You know, I'm getting bald. I have little, I'm losing hair. I will never get these hairs for me. So, and not technology, it's about sports. It's dancing. Dancing is a sport. So, uh, in my defense, I know this because I dated a person that was fanatic about. K-pop, and it was the entire day. 
keep up this, keep up that. And that's why I know, okay? I don't like it. <laughs> All right? So please don't okay. judge me. This is don't judge me, please. The teacher. Don't judge me. Uh, if, we, if you, you open you like my... Oh, if you, I don't like it. I prefer... If you open my Spotify... You like animals. If you open my Spotify player and you see all the music I listen to, it goes from, look here, it goes from Highly Thomas to the score to uh, Thick 44, POD, Suburban, uh, lots of bands of rock and the variant, you know, like Cliver, Chevelle. A Loki, okay, the rude, yeah, a lot of things here, but no K pop. Charlie put, you see, a lot of artists, no K pop, okay, thank you very much. I am happy now. So I have to delete my history after that. Julio, about the benefits of sports, what can a sport bring to your life? Okay, sport can bring a health to our life. Bring health. Mm. Yes, like uh, to avoid uh, break heart. Oh, you, okay, you can make your heart stronger. Yes, sport mm. also well. can bring us good memory. Mm -hmm. Can improve our memories, right? Yes, and keep us uh, with uh, good uh, healthy physical. Like, uh, how can I say that? Um, stronger. And stronger. Our yes, stronger and our body body keep uh, safe because of. Our, como se diz a, a, a defesa do corpo, é como se fosse... Ah, the immunity of our bodies. Yes, immunity. Yes. Mm, that's good, because it makes us better, right? Yeah. Our body uh, is going to be more, uh, have more energy and more disposal to, to work, yes? Yes. That's good. That's very nice. Do you agree that this can also happen when you uh, work out? Not only in sports. Yes, I agree, but I don't like to work out. <laughs> you don't like to work out? Why not, sir? Because my job is uh, very hard and I, I think I don't I don't have an, an energy to. You don't to have energy. What what time do you day. what what time do you work? I I make a diverse diverse guide diverse kind of work. I work. Ah, you work more than one time. Uh, and I make delivery sometimes i have uh, okay so so all your free time you spend working yeah is that uh, it? yes oh god dude you have to rest okay <laughs> i don't know please. what is vacation i think it's uh, please but try it kind of okay at least once a week you need to rest for your health okay Yes. I am looking I to the to camera. The camera is, is not turned it on, but I'm looking at the camera uh, like I'm looking to your eyes, like inside your brain, like this. Please take a moment to rest. It's important, okay? Yeah. For your physical health and for your mental health, all right? Right. Um... But if you have time, try at least 40 minutes of physical exercise a day, okay? Okay, 
you see you're going to wake up more disposed you're going to have more energy if you eat well of course if you don't eat well it's not going to have too much results but if you can try it and tell me the difference between uh two weeks of doing it okay i want to know okay if you can of course uh, let me see here. Sabrina, uh, you as a biologist, yes? So, how can sports help to bring people together from different cultures? And what are some physical and mental benefits of participating in sports or practicing exercises? Um... Do you know anything about it or no? Or less. Um, or less, I know but that share your knowledge, sports, please. I mm. know that sports help the concentration and mm. uh, like uh, quem tava falando antes? It's Julio. É, like Julio says, um, it's good for the heart and the um, the arterial pressure. Um, oh, that's important. The brain. Mm -hmm. um, let me see. Uh, for uh, all the body. <laughs> all the body, the entire body benefits, yes? Yes. That's so good. That's so nice. And I know that Chieli works out every day. Right, Shelly? Every day. <laughs> I see you skipped. <laughs> Did you go today? Uh, no. no. Uh, no <laughs> I know. <laughs> I knew it. When, when I said every day and you every day, I knew what you'd miss today. <laughs> I knew you would miss today because when I asked, did you go today? You stopped and you, mm, no. <laughs> no. Was I'm it tired? My, 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 like day, so. um, twice a week, twice mm -hmm. a week, twice a week. Yeah, twice a week. day, twice a week também. Well, twice a week too. But, you go for a week, like Sabrina. Yeah, but uh, depends. Uh, uh, depend. Oh. Uh, uh, Did you go yesterday? This week, no. Não. Yes, because because today we didn't. You didn't go. Yeah, but so, yeah. Essa semana. Did you go? Did you go yesterday? Sim. Did you go yesterday? Eu yes. fui hoje, ok. <laughs> you did you go today, Sabrina? Yes. Me too. Uh, I Me too. I, I went yesterday. Yes. Today, no. I went to the gym today too. Let me see here. I don't know if I can show this, but whatever. Where is my status? Look, I went to the gym today too. I was yes. there. É, é I can say se I was postar, there. Não foi, né? Yes, if you don't tem que post it, fazer, you didn't dizer que foi. go. Yes. See, yeah. you have to put it, no pain, no gain, you know? Yes, yes, yes. <laughs> exactly, exactly. You, you, have, you have to put in Portuguese like this. O de hoje tá pago, yes? É, hoje tá pago. Yes, o so. famoso, eu fui daqui, vocês já foram daí? Exactly. So, Kieli, you have obligation to go tomorrow, Thursday? Uh, yes. And Friday. <laughs> yes. Maybe, okay. mas quando não dá, eu compenso no sábado e domingo. Good. I, I can't go Saturday and, and Sunday because the gym I pay to go, it's not open and during the weekends. So I think I'll change. Uh, I aqui, think aqui I'll change. Aquela abre todos os dias, inclusive feriado. Jesus Christ. Todos os dias. Para quem use, né? Nós que usamos. Is, is it smart quem fit? trabalha lá, is, só Jesus. Is it smart fit? 
That you frequent? No, you já, já, fu já fui. Não, but, não... But it's not. Porque it abriu is. uma muito mais próxima da minha, da minha casa. Uh, uh, okay, body coat. Oh, that's good too. Very nice. Yeah. Guys, yeah. our time, unfortunately, is over today. Oh, Infelizmente, nosso tempo acabou hoje, ok? Mas teremos mais outra aula de avançado na sexta à noite, ok? Guys, I see you next class. Amanhã, das oito. É do beginner intermediate, tá? Do pessoal do, do iniciante do intermediário, normal, das oito às nove, tá? De noite. E de manhã também, de manhã vai ter aula de filme. Tá, então, se vocês quiserem participar da aula de filme, vocês podem entrar das 10 às 11. Eu vou passar um filminho de manhã, tá? E deixa eu ver que recado mais eu tenho para dar. Se vocês tiverem alguma dúvida, podem mandar para mim no WhatsApp, tá? Fiquem ligados na plataforma lá, que daqui uma semaninha, mais ou menos, essa aula vai estar disponível lá para vocês, tá bom? Na plataforma. Vai estar lá no, na parte de baixo da, do calendário de aula, tá lá os links, né? Com as aulas anteriores. E eu acho que de recado que eu tenho para essa semana é isso. Ok, guys? Ok. Deixa eu encerrar, deixa eu encerrar aqui a, a gravação. Ok.